Hello viewers, welcome to another video. In my previous video, I have discussed the problem associated with aluminium and copper connection. In this video, I will give you the solution of this problem in which you can easily use aluminium cables in different installation with copper terminals without any problem. So these are the examples of some of the equipment which come with the copper bus bar or copper terminals by default. For example, this is the switch gear in which normally the bus bar is made up of copper. Similarly, this is the transformer in which the bushings are made up of copper. And this is the back view of circuit breaker in which the terminals are made up of copper. So you see in most of the equipment, the terminals or the bus bar are normally made up of copper and if you want to use the aluminium cable it means that you have to use a special arrangement in order to avoid problems associated with copper aluminium connections. It means that if you want to use aluminium cable for the installation you have to use special type of component. So let me go through these problems very briefly. So first problem is the formation of aluminium oxide layer on copper aluminium joint. So this layer presented an additive resistance to the flow of current which results in an additional heat up of the joint and ultimately resulting in burning of cable or subsequently end up in the fire. The another very major problem associated with copper aluminium joint is because of the different thermal coefficients of both metals due to which both metals expand and contract at different rate in the presence of high temperature which results in the loosening of joint. For the solution of this particular problem, a special type of thimble is introduced into the market which is called biometallic thimble. This thimble is made up of two different metals. The barrel is made up of forged electrolytic aluminium and the palm is made up of electrolytic forged copper. Both these metals are friction welded to each other and because of this stir friction welding, both these metals are bonded together to create a very strong and durable joint, therefore achieving the best possible transition between these two metals. Also. You can see that the barrel is made up of aluminium. So there is always a chance of oxidation appear in the aluminium barrel. In order to avoid this problem, this barrel is prevented by protecting the inside layer of this barrel with special type of grease with a very high dropping point. These biometallic cable lugs are suitable for connecting low voltage, medium voltage and high voltage standard aluminium conductor cables with a voltage ranging between 11 to 33 kilovolts and with the cross sectional areas of 10 to 630 square mm. So I hope you understand how you can use aluminium cables in different installation without any problem. I hope you like this video. For more interesting videos, stay tuned and don't forget to subscribe our channel.